Hello, Toy Geeks, and all you nerds out there. Thanks a lot for tuning in once again to uh, my channel. Ako si Cholo, and I am a toy collector. And today, I'm going to do a very quick unboxing of some stuff that I got from the Big Boys Toy Store Sumo Sale. That's right. Uh, the Sumo Sale is something that a lot of you toy geeks look forward to. Because, uh, you, well, if you are a true toy fan, then you all know, of course, about uh, Big Boys Toy Store. You know, our good friends from Big Boys, uh, Sean Mendoza and Jeffrey and uh, all of the lovely girls from Big Boys. Uh, they <laughs> make it a point that every year they have something for us toy fans to look forward to. And uh, this year they did not disappoint. So I dropped by uh, Big Boys Toy Store over at Green Hills Promenade. And uh, true enough, the hype is real. Yeah. Yes, Sumo Sale is back and they have big discounts and big promos such as buy one take one, buy two take one, and uh, of course a big uh, slash in their uh, usual uh, uh, prices for uh, their very cool collectibles over at the Big Boy Toy Store. So without any further ado, and uh, mind you this only this took me only about 30 minutes of, uh, you know, <laughs> very quick rush uh, buying at uh, the uh, Sumo Sale. This is their first day, actually, August 30. Uh, this goes on until September 4, if I'm not mistaken, Sunday, over at the uh, Upper Box Promenade in Green Hills. Okay, so if you go to the promenade at Green Hills, uh, go if you go uh, three flights up the stairs, then you're at the Upper Box Promenade of... Uh, of Green Hills Shopping Center, okay? Promenade Mall, that is, over at Green Hills. All right, so I'll show you a little bit of what I was able to uh, <laughs> quickly gather uh, at the uh, Big Boy Sumo Sale, starting off with uh, some really cool cheapos, but uh, they may be cheap, but uh, when, yeah. you do, when you're when you you know doing the hunt, these are really cool items. So uh, first up, we have a Marvel Universe uh, Patriot, okay? So this MU Patriot, went uh, for as low as just $2.99 from its original SRP of $5.50, but actually on the market now, this is uh, uh, pretty much a very rare collectible because uh, the MU uh, line has already, uh, you know, has already finished. Okay, and pretty sure somewhere down the road, MCU is going to have uh, Marvel's uh, Junior Captain America in the person of uh, the... Uh, Young Avengers Patriot. Okay, so mind you, two ninety nine, not bad. All right, uh, another Marvel character I got is this uh, Rock Candy. Okay, uh, I'm not really into this line, but I have a few of them. Uh, this is a Funko uh, product and Rock Candy. I like, of course, uh, the character Hela. Okay, I like it very much from Thor Ragnarok, and I also got that for cool two ninety nine. All right, so that's uh, Rock Candy's uh, Thor Ragnarok Hela. And another very cheap item is uh, this really cool Star Wars Rebel Rebels uh, shirt from Funko. Okay, uh, this would typically uh, ring you up around 1,000 or 1,500, but 299, not bad for an original Funko shirt. Okay, but this is large and uh, uh, Funko shirts are U.S. sizes, so uh, mind you, they are uh, bigger than your usual uh, size. So a large would probably be uh, an extra, an XL or a double XL even. Uh, okay, so that's uh, a few of the cheap ones that I got. Uh, and uh, the following are also, you know, uh, just basing it on their uh, retail price, quite a good uh, markdown. All right, so I got myself. Uh, I've been holding out on this figure, and I think I got this at the best price possible. So this is Night King from the Game of Thrones by uh, McFarlane. All right, this uh, I think retail for about uh, 1,500. So it's uh, yes, the hype is real. Uh, Big Boy Sumo Sale. They are at 50% off for all McFarlanes. So uh, I was able to score this for just 700. Okay, so this is uh, the Night King from the Game of Thrones. Uh, McFarlane line, okay. I there are still a couple of uh, the other uh, Game of Thrones figures, but I didn't get them because uh, I just like uh, I just like this one, okay. And uh, a few more McFarlanes. I got this one because uh, I've also been holding out on these, and uh, as you can see, they are quite uh, 
beautiful because these are deluxe McFarlane's uh, would originally retail for about 1500 and of course they are uh, slashed uh, 50 percent it's this is 700 Batman Beyond and of course it goes with the uh, the build a figure collect to build uh, Batman uh, futures end so I got the torso there along with the uh, Batman Beyond and uh, well I also of course got uh, a few more from that set this is uh, Batwoman Beyond okay with the legs of that Batman and I also got uh, this character that I don't really know but this is a uh, shriek I just got this for the uh, for the arms of the uh, Batman figure that you would uh, collect to build okay so uh, I didn't get the last one although it was still available uh, I think it was a Luthor uh, figure as part of this set but it only had like the uh, appendages or the tentacles of that Batman build the figure so I didn't get that anymore uh, don't really wanna oh okay anyway more McFarlane's okay this one I was really tempted to get because it was really cheap uh, from a th 1300 to just 650 for a uh, Raven Spawn. That's a really cool uh, McFarlane figure. Raven Spawn. Again, uh, I was a big fan of uh, the original McFarlane figures, but when they reissued this, you know, they were eye candy, but uh, finally got to, to own them for, for that price. It's a no brainer. 650. And another no brainer is uh, this figure just because it's really big i got it for uh what would you sh you know what would cost me around three thousand pesos uh at less than half the price uh one thousand four hundred okay for the spawn violator and this is an awesome big toy it's very heavy okay uh definitely worth that Price because uh, well uh, th at that price point you would usually get a figure you know as small as this but uh, you get this big box figure for just for just 1,400 that's a very good deal indeed okay even if I'm not that big a spawn fan uh, I think that would do well uh, resold okay <laughs> all right and I got a couple of these Funko products uh, this this one is a, a, another defunct line called Vinyl, V Y N L. All right, I, I like these because these are Star Wars, uh, and I got uh, a Jabba and Salacious Crumb. And as you can see from the price, just uh, five hundred pesos for that one. All right, uh, that's the price point of a Funko figure, but still a very cool collectible. So uh, Vinyl, Jabba the Hutt, and I also got uh, this pair, Han Solo and Greedo. Uh, in the vinyl slime, just because I like, you know, Han Solo. Uh, 500 bucks for the pair. Not bad. Okay, and more Mark Farlands. All right, couldn't resist this one because I have uh, the uh, Batman uh, 66 figures. So uh, I was also holding off on this and this one went on sale talking about uh, McFarlane's uh, Batman 66 Batcave set. Okay, so that's the Batcave set, and this one rang me up about 900 big bucks, all right? But again, very cheap from uh, uh, its uh, retail price, so good deal, good deal on the uh, Batcave. I was hoping to uh, find uh, the uh, Batman 66 McFarlane figures. They had a couple, but they just had the, uh, uh, you know, the villains, Joker, Riddler, uh, I think... Uh, uh, Batman in the in the beach shorts, uh, but they didn't have the uh, Batman original Batman sixty six anymore. Okay, and one last, oops, sorry, one last McFarlane figure reaching into the box for this one, a very good deal indeed. This is uh, My Hero Academia's uh, Katsuki Bakugo, very cool figure, very big figure, also very heavy, and this one rang me up just. Uh, 700 pesos not bad at all all right for a very articulated mcfarlane figure and this one has lights and sounds it's a 12 inch bakugo and uh, my kids and i are fans of uh, my hero academia all right and finally i think i have one a few more okay of course this one i think i just couldn't resist okay this is star wars the empire strikes back uh luke in training with Yoda yeah 
All right. Uh, of course, I didn't go for this uh, when it sold at SRP for like close to. Two two thousand seven hundred pesos, but now it's about one thousand eight hundred. Not bad uh, for the price that would probably get you just one Star Wars deluxe figure. You get a uh, two pack Yoda and uh, Luke Skywalker in training. Of course, that's part of the uh, Star Wars Black Series fortieth anniversary line. So again, a very good find in the uh, big boy sumo sale and uh, just two more uh, items that I got which I was very excited about when I saw it you know I made a beeline for it and right after I I got them I saw a couple of people just looking at me and they said whoa, whoa that pair you really have to get that pair and I'm talking about the uh, gigantic uh, Kong versus Godzilla uh, pop movies uh, 10 inch pops <laughs> all right so this is King Kong the 10-inch uh, pop of King Kong, uh, way at 50% off almost. Uh, so this rang me up around two, uh, 1,800. Not bad for a gigantic uh, pop figure. And of course, if you have Kong, you have got to have Godzilla. Yes. So this is the uh, the Godzilla 10-inch uh, vinyl pop figure, uh, pop movies, and this is. Uh, uh, a little bit, uh, a little bit more pricey, but uh, just uh, rang me up uh, uh, around two thousand two hundred. There you go. That's the uh, Godzilla ten-inch pop. Amazing, amazing finds at the uh, sumo sale of Big Boys. I would highly recommend it. I want to thank our good friends from Big Boys, uh, Sean and Jeff, and uh, big help also from uh, the ladies, uh, Jack, and uh, the rest of you girls. Thank you so much for assisting me, uh, as always. You know, I, again, this took me all of like 30 minutes just to... <laughs> <laughs> quickly rush through uh, a lot of great stuff they have a uh, a room of uh, Funko Pops that are at priced at 299 pesos only uh, those are good buys and there there are a lot of those I think will will uh, you won't run out of uh, those Funko Pops until until Sunday when the sumo sale ends but there are a couple of uh, nice finds also uh, at uh, markdown prices uh, they had a couple of Kotobukiya statues which I would have wanted to buy but I you know I just didn't ha have enough time uh, there are a couple of Iron Studio statues also that were really cool a lot of Funko Pops uh, and there were also some lines that uh, I you know uh, are probably uh, not offered anymore. They had a couple of Marvel Legends, a lot of DC figures, you know, everything is marked down. So uh, there, do find yourself at the Big Boys Sumo Sale this entire weekend starting, uh, well, today, August 30 until Sunday, September 4. And uh, say hi to the good friends of uh, at Big Boys and uh, they have a lot of things uh, for you to find there, you know, and all it takes is a good eye and a little patience and uh, hopefully a little luck also. So enjoy this weekend's uh, great sales uh, and of course the Big Boys Sumo Sale. So uh, thanks a lot and uh, stay tuned for more great toy content here on this channel. See ya! Will inherit the earth.